This is the first watering event using private water on a private wetland um, as part of the Murray-Darling Basin Balance Water Fund. It makes available water to irrigators at the times they need it most. And some of that water gets kept for the environment and that's what we're seeing today, is watering for these really important private wetlands um, that occur throughout the Golden Broken but also throughout the southern Murray-Darling Basin. We're all seeking the same thing, we're all seeking to see improvements in the health and condition of our particular wetlands and this is just one other avenue which we can achieve that. It supports a whole variety of different wetland birds and, and plants and it's, it looks alright now but I think in a couple of months time um, when the weather warms up and the water's been delivered it's going to be looking spectacular. The challenge is uh, with farming, you've been, it is the connectivity between developing and running a viable, economically viable farming operation and managing the environment. That, they're two objectives that need to be symbiotic and if they're not symbiotic they're not going to work. Yes, we looked at all those, I guess, ecological um, values that the wetland had and they matched up with what the working group and the trust want to achieve in the long term and the willing landowner. So you put all that together and you've got a site that um, everyone wants to try and get some water on it. This feeds the, the billabongs in the national park so um, when this floods it will flow into those billabongs and that benefits the wider community and the whole of Australia can benefit from that national park and the resource that it presents.